Cobra is a new way of fighting fires from outside of the building. So you don't have to put firefighters into the very hot environments. What it is, is a very fine jet of water at over 300 bars pressure. And at that pressure, it water has the capability of cutting through most things, including reinforced, con reinforced concrete and steel. But to assist it, what we do is we entrain a graphite cutting material, a bit like iron filings, into the water stream, which means it can cut through just about anything. Um, but the, the important thing is once you're through into the compartment fire itself, the water at 300 bars pressure becomes very atomized, which sends the surface area up dramatically, which means you can absorb heat much faster than ever before. That means it's safer for both people in the compartment because you're extinguishing the fire much faster. It's also safer for firefighters because you're not putting them in to that hot environment. And because you're using very small amounts of water to do this, it's actually safer for the environment. So you've got a win-win-win scenario. We can deliver that mist without opening up the compartment. We can deliver it without entering the compartment in breathing apparatus. And we can reduce the temperature inside the compartment and the conditions before we commit a BA team to fight fire. By deploying Cobra into a fire compartment without opening, we may deploy for 60 seconds. We may take temperatures from 4, 5, 6, 700 degrees down to 70, 80 degrees in the space of 60 seconds. We've run trials using Cobra at a high-rise instance where we've deployed conventional tactics and methods and timed them uh, over a period of trials. Uh, and we've looked at uh, creating a scenario on a fire floor where fire crews have to enter into them. Uh, we've run the same trials by using Cobra and we have saved 17 minutes from time of deployment from when fire crews would have had to open up the fire compartment to when Cobra could be deployed. So we've, we, we can prevent, uh, on the scenarios that we've run, 17 minutes of fire development from uh, occurring by deploying Cobra into a fire compartment much quicker. Cobra only uses 60 litres of water a minute, so it uses a litre a second. It's able to do this because it uses it much more efficiently. It breaks the droplets down into 0.1 of a mil diameter, which is much smaller than we're able to create by our conventional methods of delivering water. By only using 60 litres of water, more of the water we deliver is all being used up, turning to steam, reducing the temperature and conditions inside the fire compartment. We're not having large amounts of contaminated water runoff from incidents where we use Cobra, and we're able to have a much faster intervention. So we're able to change the conditions and the emissions from fire compartments very, 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 very quickly. The Cobra works very fast indeed. Uh, as we've seen today, a typical 20-foot container-style operation, which is, is about the equivalent of your adult, of your normal everyday. Uh, living room fire was extinguished in under 60 seconds so it's very quick to operate indeed but importantly you're using very little water and the firefighters are not exposed to all of that heat. Cobra was originally came from the tarmac in industry they used to use high pressure jets of water to cut nice square holes in the in tarmac so that you could patch the potholes very easily with tarmac a Swedish company saw this in use and, and connected it with the ability to firefight as cold cut systems and they now have got the worldwide patent and have produced this for use all around the world in firefighting.